Folks, welcome back to the Wild West Crypto Show. And let me tell you something. I mean, it just keeps getting more and more exciting. And, and we are honored to have. I'm Drew Taylor. And I'm Brent Bates. You bet. And folks, we are at World CryptoCon in Las Vegas. And we have Bitcoin. Ben is in the house. Yes. <laughs> ben, tell us. And obviously, you're a big YouTube influencer. I mean, you got a big following. Yes. And you're a truck driver. I am. Running out. You get to see the cross section of all of America. Well, I'm local now. Okay. All right. I, uh, I was actually over the road and, uh, and the little woman woman wasn't too happy with that. Now her her actual boyfriend loved it. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> she yeah. didn't like it and uh, and I uh, I learned about cryptocurrency because when you're on the road you got a lot of time to you know listen to things and stuff like that. And, you bet. Uh, and truck drivers ain't right anyway. So uh, <laughs> we or I started to listen to cryptos and podcasts right. and stuff like that, and I educated myself on blockchain, uh, and then I actually started buying a little bit here, a little bit there, yeah. and, uh, and ever since then, then about a year and a half ago, because uh, I like talking, although I do have a speech in front of me. That's all right, man. Hey, yeah. hey, hey, like I say, it's going to take me a little while to say it, but you'll like what you hear. Well, well let me tell you, I have a speech in better. I talk too fast. Yeah. <laughs> my, my wife tries to get me to take some of that drink from those last folks yeah. to calm down a little bit. Yeah, there so, you go. Speaking of some of the last folks, I, you know, I, this is something you need to put out to the truck driver community. We learned something pretty profound here today. And, and that was the, the lady that we had who her, her boyfriend gave her a Bitcoin on their first date. And they're still dating, and it's oh. years later. I mean, that? Is that the she, best pickup line you've ever heard? Baby, here's a Bitcoin. My name's there's a hoblet joke in there somewhere. <laughs> there's a hoblet joke in there somewhere. And if we had enough time, we'd find it. <laughs> exactly. But, uh, yeah, I, um, uh, uh, I just love, like, cryptocurrency. I love the, uh, uh, the advancement of of the technology, the you community, bet. and I love doing my videos. I do them in my truck most of the time. I'll do get, you really? Yeah, because yeah. whenever you're getting loaded or unloaded, you got a little bit of time to yeah. sit there. And, well, yeah. but I, it, folks, by loaded and unloaded, he's talking about the truck. Okay. Yeah. 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 Well, <laughs> <laughs> oh, is that what you were talking about? <laughs> truck drivers don't drink. <laughs> All right, hey, that, hey, that, that, have, that's just in case like a DOT rep yeah, is watching. Yeah, yeah. Now I have an affinity for truck drivers because, and I love the bumper stickers. So from you're Diego. the person walking around the lot. Well, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, they say if you've got it, a truck brought it. That's true. And, and there's an old, uh, there's an old C.W. McCall. Me and Earl was hauling chickens on a flatbed out of Wiggins, and uh, you know, yeah, no, I know. Yeah, boom, yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Everyone who's not a truck driver is going. Well, they don't. Know <laughs> but yeah, it, um, it. I love like what you guys are doing. And as soon as I realized you guys were here, I was like, my people, because you know, there's so many smart people. I'm like, I'm not saying y'all. Oh. That, that's not what I'm saying. You're implying we have a brain impediment. We got a picture, We got a brain impediment. Well, I figure if we're all talking, we might come up with one like cogent thought. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, you know, truck drivers ought to love cryptocurrency because one of the neat thing about it is it kind of democratizes money and investing and, and all of that. And, and I hope that you continue to have the impact that you're having, especially within the trucking community, because, like, you know, those are some hardworking guys. My grandfather was a truck driver. In fact, no, he was a trucking mogul. He had four trucks in North Whoa. Little Rock, Arkansas, you know, back in the 40s and the 50s. Yeah. Fact, that was back when they barely had trucks. Uh, Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. In fact, you know, he no, they didn't have rules. But yeah. Hours of operation oh, no, didn't no, no, exist. No. Yeah. And yeah. guess what? You know who unloaded and loaded the truck? Him. My dad. My dad's Ooh. got wrists that are this wide from taking 80 pound bags of cotton uh, meal and flipping them up onto the bed of the truck from picking them up off the ground. Well, obviously, you can see they don't make you do that no more. <laughs> <laughs> I sit in the truck and go, Get at it, boys. That's it. Well, no, wait, so you sit in the truck and go, this is Bitcoin Ben. Let me tell you about cryptocurrency. <laughs> hey, hey, exactly. Folks, if you've been in a modern semi, they are not a truck. They are a control center, man. Yeah, he's yeah. he's in here. When he talks about doing a show from there, I go, my wife and I travel a lot in a motor coach, you know, oh, in a big class A coach. RV? It, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're so, fancy. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. I'm, the load I'm hauling is all my wife's stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, from the shopping mall. Exactly. Oh, I got exactly. You. But 
but it is something to see these truckers with. I mean, you got screens and all this stuff going everywhere, and uh, you know. And I'm like, I'm just hanging on to my Freightliner. You know? <laughs> it, it, well, I don't drive a, fa a Freightliner. I drive a Peterbilt. Okay, yeah. well, yeah. you know, and, yeah. And like I tell people, I got the biggest Peter in town. <laughs> <laughs> but I, um, uh, it's 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 the environment that really attracted me, and uh, I'm actually a libertarian. Oh, so yeah. Like live and let live. Now, are you guys from Texas? Oh right? yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, I, what gave I, it away? Well, <laughs> not only the accent, but you got. Uh, I, in fact, me and my wife have been talking about moving down. It's Texas because we can smell the freedom from the. Oh dirt. yeah, you and can. And the barbecue. Yeah, and oh, the barbecue. Yeah, yeah. yeah. certain yeah. parts of the country, the beer. <laughs> hey, actually, I am known for chicken wings and beer. I know. Oh, that's right. all I need is chicken wings and beer, and I'm good to go. I'm a simple man. There you go, man. There you go. But uh, I, as soon as I heard you guys were here, I was like, oh my god, I gotta at least you know say hi or something to you guys uh, we're, we're pleased to have you on you know one of the things that we do ben and it's the reason we went from doing our first show in january and we are terrestrial radio on about 100 radio stations you know regular radio oh, stations. Awesome. so we reach a lot of the folks that you reach with your stuff and our goal was when everybody's on youtube and doing podcasts and all that i mean it's the choir singing to the choir mm -hmm. so when we decided to do this whole thing we said listen we need to get on the real airwaves and reach the old rednecks out there in their pickup trucks that are hauling hay so that we can educate them about this the future of money which is what this is absolutely you know? A, uh, actually in in st louis missouri where i'm from i uh i used to have a radio show locally oh really and uh the fcc changed my mind on that because <laughs> they, <laughs> they they didn't told like what you said huh? well they uh it was that peter joke <laughs> yeah. Well, it had something to do with Peter, but it, 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 it's something different. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, so I left radio and I opened up a remodeling company. And, and this is going to sound kind of crazy, but I kind of retired out of construction in to driving a truck okay yeah. and um, and I love driving a truck and I, I always have and um, and now that I'm on YouTube and I've uh, apparently for some reason people like watching me. <laughs> well, I, I, we're having I wish my wife right here, liked but... looking at me as much as those people did. <laughs> my wife likes me being on the radio because yeah. she can turn it off. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Strange you say that because I turn off my wife all the time. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, uh, so I had a show and uh, it lasted about a year and a little bit of change and uh, and then I walked away from that remodeling now I'm doing trucking now I'm doing YouTube and uh, and I'm just rolling along and c cryptocurrencies and blockchain and uh, and all that really piqued my interest and I've uh, and I'm very big on talking. You'd think it's odd a guy that can't talk well but likes just, to talk. Just keep on talking. You know? Well, that's what I do. I figure somebody's got to be listening. <laughs> and uh, so I do my show, uh, which you can actually find if it's Yeah, no, no, please, oh, please. Uh, I'm actually on YouTube under, you know, Bitcoin Ben. And... Um, and my show's not like the uh, the the usual cryptocurrency right. show. I'm uh, I do a lot of jokes, a lot of comedy, and stuff no. like that. But yeah, I know, right? <laughs> so, um, but I I'm I'm a lar I'm a larger picture guy, and um, so I don't really talk about price. Uh, I talk. A, of how the technology is going to change the average truck driver's life. Yeah, you bet. You know, yeah. uh, the, That's perfect. Uh, the average like person that works at a shop and yeah. says, "You bet, you, you bet." Because we're uh, we're all we're all actually going to be touched by it. It's just has it touched you yet? And uh, it will touch you. I, I tell you what, folks, he's talking about cryptocurrency, okay? Oh, yeah. Just to be clear. Yeah. Well, you know, as ben, far as they know. <laughs> I tell you what, Ben, I, in the future, we'd love to kind of hook up with you, whether it's on Zoom or in some fashion. You know, you can you can show it on your show. We'll show it on our show and, and kind of have you as, you know, we've got people throughout the world that we're doing this. I don't know that we've got a mobile trucker we that's doing it. Man, yeah. We don't, man. Yeah. We've got one now. Yeah. He's, he's the man. Okay? You bet. 
And yeah. so we're going to stay in touch with you. What's the best way other than the YouTube? Do you do any of the social media stuff? Uh, or I'm on Facebook Twitter. Or? Finally figured that out. Uh, uh, <laughs> remember that whole joke about the Peter? Yeah. Well, that's how I thought the Twitter worked. Well, okay, all right. And, uh, <laughs> so now that once I kind of figured it out, yes, you can find me on Twitter. And, uh, and Are you Bitcoin Ben on Twitter? Is that uh, your handle? I, or? Uh, yes, and I also have an official website now that, uh, like, I have a smart wife. I know being married yeah. to me may prove different. Yeah, but, yeah, yeah. Uh, she actually created a website which is actually Bitcoin or www.bitcoinben.io. Okay, okay, they're good, okay. good. And uh, if you guys want to check me out, uh, if you guys like these guys, you'll love me. <laughs> I, 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 I take what's complicated, I break it down in easy to understand pieces. And that's what we work to do. So, so let me tell you something. Education. We'd love to have you bring your little wife to Texas. But in Texas, we don't much go with her bringing her boyfriend. So you may not want to do that part of it. You <laughs> well, know. I, you yeah, know, I'll just tell them to take a break for a little while. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, there you like go. lay off my woman. <laughs> ben, Bitcoin Ben, thank you for coming on the Wild West Crypto <laughs> Show. Well, thank Look you. Look forward to having you on more, okay? Awesome. Great time. <laughs> All right. Thank you, buddy. No problem. Thanks.